No, I didn't design this. It was an already built circuit board that came with a bunch of electronic components that I got. Sound activated silicon controlled rectifier. The silicon controlled rectifier is right there. And there is the crystal microphone used to activate it. I'll have it running a light bulb. Now this is not very sensitive. You have to speak loudly and close to the mic. Just watch it operate. Uh, uh. It works. And the silicon control rectifier stays on until you cut the power off. Uh. See, it's not very sensitive. That's pretty cool. The reed switch is a very special kind of switch in which it has two little reed, two, two little me, um, metal pieces inside that when you put a magnet t to it, they will touch together to conduct electricity. Here we see one operate. There's the reed switch and there's a light bulb. The magnet is inside here. When you put the magnet near the reed switch, close enough, it will conduct. I'm not going to show it actually operate, but here is a mercury switch, which you simply slide the mercury down and it touches to contacts. It's still in a package. It's really cool. You've probably seen these in thermostats, the older thermostats. Here is a smaller one right here in a metal container. Let's try counting how many times the reed switch is activated. But you'll notice reed switch isn't a good way to get a signal into a counter. But it tends to count in a very strange way. Other than through the traditional way of counting, which is like this.